So I'm here with my uh, client Tim from the uh, overhead squat video and basically we're going to be going over uh, two different muscle groups and we're just showing him uh, self-mouth fascial release on the foam roller, uh, PNF, so proprioceptive neuromuscular uh, facilitation, so it's different stretching and then static stretching. So the first muscle group we're going to go with is the biceps femoris. So I'll get Tim to lie down on his uh, butt and basically put one single leg over top, yeah, just like so. And if you want, you can cross your leg over to add a little bit more pressure onto there. And so when you're hitting the biceps femoris, it's part of the hamstring. So you want to bring this foot and just outwardly rotate, because that's where the, you're going to hit the biceps femoris. So you want to just slowly roll onto it until you find that one little point of pressure. Should be a little bit of discomfort. Ooh. Yeah. And when you find it, you want to sim that for about 30 seconds. So just give her. Does it feel a lot of pressure on there? Yeah. I'm perfect. So just give her and just hold it on there. And that just kind of lengthens up the fascia and everything. So it should feel a little bit of pain and everything, but it looks good so far. So keep that up. Rotated. Perfect. That's good. All right. Okay, so we'll move on to the uh, just a basic static stretch. And so the one I have for this one will be standing, basically same leg. You're just going to stand and set your foot, and you want to go past your ball, past the other leg. So you're going to set it right here, keeping this foot straight. This one on, just on a chair or something, and you just want to turn your body until you feel that tension. And once you feel that, you're going to hold that one for also 30 seconds. So just facing forward, put it past the other leg. Yep. And just give your body a turn. You should feel a stretch in the same place. Mm -hmm. Yeah, perfect. Right. Right. Yeah, just hold that for 30 seconds. Just basic, basic static stretching. Good. Yeah, that. Sure. Alright, so now we're going to do the uh, PNF stretching. Uh, I don't really have a massage table, so I use my pool table. Uh, basically, it's very similar to the standing uh, biceps more stretch. I'm just going to have my client raise his leg and extend it as far as he can up this way, keeping his uh, butt and shoulders still on the ground. And basically, with PNF stretching, you want him to kind of fight using the antagonist muscles for 7 to 15 seconds. And then you want to pull it past that last point range of motion for 20 to 30. So whenever you want, give me a little resistance for 7 to 15. Yeah, a little hard. Yeah, just relax those muscles. Perfect. All right, relax. Basically, I'm just going to take you past it. Keep relaxing. We'll hold this for 30 seconds. How's that feel? Good. Awesome. All right. And give it to me once more. No pressure. keep pushing past the last range of motion after he uh, actively uh, works against you and you want to do this about two to three times until you reach that, uh, that end range of motion. So we could do it once more but for the sake of the video we'll, uh, we'll just end it there. Right now for the second muscle we're going to do we're going to do the piriformis. So it's just right in the uh, lower just above the leg here it's just right along the glute medius. So basically I'm going to have you sit down again very similar to the first one we did but this time we'll do the left side of your body. So you're going to have your leg, yep, coming over perfectly, and you're just going to sit on the foam roller, and you're just going to kind of foam roll right in there. You kind of want a little bit of lean, you should be able to feel a nice bit of stretch. Once you find that place, 20 to 30 seconds again, just kind of sit on there and hold it. You know, the leg goes over, kind of opens it up, and also allows for a lot more pressure to be put on that certain muscle. So just kind of sit there and feel it, should be nice. Mm -hmm. Found it. Alright, that's all good. We'll move on. We'll go to the static stretch now. A bunch of different ones you can do for this one. The, the simple one that most people do is just the laying on the ground basic one where you're just like this and kind of hold here. A uh, different modification you can do that I find stretches it out a lot more is you basically just sit, sit on a chair, one leg over the other, and then just grab underneath the leg. And the more you bend forward, the more pull you'll feel in it. So if you want, give, grab our seat. Same leg you just hit, so knee over the other, yep. Yeah. Reach through the leg, kind of through, yep. Yeah. And the more you lean forward, the more you should feel that pull on the left side. So, and then again, with static stretching, you want to kind of hold it for 20 to 30 seconds. Just feel that stretch, nice and easy. Awesome, so just get over feel that. Mm -hmm. All right. Good. All right, and uh, lastly, we're going to do the uh, PNF stretch with the uh, piriformis. 
Very similar, just like the bicep femoris one. This time you're going to get your client to bring up his knee just like all the other ones we've been doing with the last two. And I'm going to be pulling his leg, making sure his shoulders and his, and his uh, hips stay on the ground. So I'm going to be pulling this way. And then for the 7 to 15 seconds, he's going to be fighting you, so go ahead. Yeah, perfect. Yeah. He's using his uh, adductors to, uh, to fight the muscles, so... Alright, so 10 seconds, so then we'll all pull. So I'll pull a little farther. Perfect, find that extra little range of motion. 20 to 30 seconds. And again, just like the, the, the biceps from Morris, we're going to be doing this one until we find that end range of motion. It shouldn't take more than... Uh, two or three cycles. So, whenever you want, ready? One more fight. Perfect, and relax. I'm just gonna pull a little farther than last time. Feel that stretch? Mm -hmm. Awesome. All right. Perfect.